sledding yesterday. We managed to get dinner, came back to the hostel, shut it down. Now we're gonna go and try and see a couple of things we did yesterday. We yeah. Um, it is cloudy, so it probably will rain at some point again today, but we hopefully and, beat it. And rain covers for a bit. Yeah. So hopefully not as bad. It was insane. And then it tonight, was and then tonight, oh, very special plans. But you'll have to keep watching. <laughs> To the water palace. Finally, no flooding. Yeah. Flooding. It was still after, after. Okay, so after it like flooded, we went back, shut down the hostel, and then when we went out for dinner, it was like everything was like back to normal. It's so weird. It was, like, <laughs> I thought the drainage system. Well, it was bad. It was like there was massive flooding, but it was like it was good enough that it cleared it out in a couple hours. But yeah. So we're good to get go this morning at least. Really pretty. You just walk around here. You can't go into the palace or anything. There's so. like little. Junk shops, tourist carpet mat things with junk all over laid in everywhere. But we'll take a walk, get hassled for a little bit. Jal Mahal, the water palace, is located in the northern portion of Jaipur on the way to Amur. This five story building is not open to visitors, but if you need a new Instagram picture while you get harassed to buy cheap junk, this is a worthwhile stop on the way to the fort. So, Stace, we're now walking along the side of the highway towards the Monkey Temple, which was the plan. Uh, why? Why, you ask? Well, good question, Stacy. It's because another rickshaw driver who's a piece of shit. He played this, like, game of, like, all oh, honesty and stuff. And oh, all these other guys do commissions and shit. And then he said, oh, it's on commission for this, like, elephant place, which the other guy tried to do yesterday. And we're like, God damn it, he's one of them. And then he tried to get us to, like, pay to fuel up his thing and then pay him for our rides on top. You know, then when we're like, oh, you know, we'll just go to here. Just drop us off. We're not interested in your all your shit. Just drop us off. And he's like tripled the price. So now we're walking on the side of the road. We are walking to the Monkey Temple because, Stacy, do you know what isn't full of shit? It's the best mode of transportation, and it isn't trying to fucking rip you off. These bad boys. Fucking Chulace Express. So that's what we're doing now. On the gate to the monkey temple and you actually walk up to the up there temple. to the sun temple and then you walk back down which we both thought was the monkey temple initially yeah a little disappointing because it's so hot but that's okay so then we're just heading down into this little valley it should be just like 200 more meters or so yeah reasonably easy walk lots of monkeys at the beginning but we haven't seen any since it wasn't a million degrees it'd be an easy walk yeah exactly this is the ancient Hindu pilgrimage site, Galtaji. It consists of a few buildings hidden between mountain crevices with a natural spring that flows into and fills the ponds and pools of the temples. This temple is not a tribute to the monkey god Hanuman, but rather is known as the monkey temple in guidebooks because of the large monkey troop that inhabits the site. Okay, so monkey temple's a little bit of a letdown. Honesty time. The temples themselves are not that nice. The inside valley is cool. Yeah, it's like we're surrounded on all our sides by these like oh there we are by like these steep green lush mountain hill cliffs uh, it's a really good location uh, it's terrible real estate though and it's not that many monkeys like there's it's like it's one two two that's the two there's six here <laughs> maybe there's seven more at the entrance yeah before like the not out. at the before the sun temple I had higher expectations for the amount of monkeys that's like probably my biggest letdown but kind of neat but eh. Okay, update. So we are on our way out. Those partying band things have showed up. But monkeys showed up. Where are they all? I swear they're here now. There's some monkeys. There's some monkeys. Monkeys and monkeys and monkeys. The monkeys. So I guess there's like more than seven. Maybe there's like 11. Oh, 
साथ में तुमको थोड़ी Mandir Theater. Uh, we were gonna do a show later tonight, but the one that's like the most Bollywood looking film, like this one, another one's about like a sports team. Only the sports team one plays at night. And so now when we're here, we wanna buy tickets. This one's the one that's playing during the day. We're gonna see if we can't get tickets right now for a show in like an hour. And we'll just do it spontaneously now instead of later tonight. So, wish us luck. And you know, this is apparently a great place to come to the movies here in India, one. And then in Jaipur, it's like the place to come. So we're gonna check out one of the movies here to hopefully in an hour. Okay, we got our tickets, we got our got our seats, and it's air conditioned. Of course it is. Uh, yeah, it's really cool in here. So we're gonna get some concession and then we're gonna enjoy our movie. Our like over the top, hopefully it's like nuts. Hopefully it's like too much. You're like, come on guys, turn it down. <laughs> But yeah, it should be really good. Got a popcorn. Curtains raising. I'm enjoying the elevator music. Yeah, it's dope music. Yeah, we're both pretty excited for this. Hopefully it's good. The Pride of Rajasthan. Alright. But we're not in plagiarism, so we'll see you after the movie. It's so intermission. It's intermission. We're thoroughly enjoying this. The movie's chaos. It makes no sense. <laughs> the bad guy is like a half. He's like half bad, half good. Yeah, he's the hunk. But Everybody in, cheered when he came on. Yeah, and like he's like clearly the bad guy. He's like burning people alive. But. But they're bad people. Yeah, yeah, okay, but the good guy never burns the bad people alive, they like, do in you know, Bollywood, Bollywood, apparently. But it's like, so he's like a real sexed up bad guy. Yeah. And everybody seems to identify with him the most. And he's a sensitive artist. Yeah, he's gone from burning people alive to like, picking up a puppy out of the garbage. <laughs> yeah. Like, taking it to a vet, where he like, had like a romantic montage with a girl. Anyways. Yeah. So great. Spoiler alert. So great. Yeah, it's intermission. We're enjoying it. Weird. It's really funny seeing everybody. Um, oh, lights are changing. changing. Everybody's Everybody cheering and laughing. And oh, and the comedic relief is like this little fat guy. Typical. Classic. But of course, like we yeah, don't have any idea what's actually going on. No. So. Anyways. Yeah, the yeah, so we'll be back in at the end, and we're on our way out. It ended sort of abruptly. Yeah, it's like he died. In the Oh, spoiler, spoiler alert. alert. Anyways, um, yeah, it ended sort of abruptly. But it was good. It was just it was sort of silly. There's less dance numbers than I wanted. But an uh, appropriate number of silly sort of fights. So that's it for us for the night. I think we're done after this. Just grab some food, shut her down. Okay, it's another early morning train journey for us here out of Jaipur. And now we are off to Agra. <laughs> 